We had a major problem with our heating systems. We had several buildings built in the 1980s, and the heating systems were dying, the controls, the air handlers. They were all beyond repair. The boilers were originally coal boilers that had been converted to natural gas, and we needed to replace these heating systems, and we had no funds to do so. North San Pete's been around for a while, and originally the buildings were built around technology for coal. They were very expensive to maintain. And that was kind of the genesis of the project, is how do we figure out a way to replace the boilers in a self-funded project? So the project would pay for itself based on future energy savings. We ended up replacing the boilers, the air handlers, doing some lighting and some weatherization. But it was the Rocky Mountain Power Blue Sky program that allowed us to bring in the solar. So the savings come from reducing their energy spend. And so that's when we started looking at the Rocky Mountain Power Blue Sky program and when we were able to get that funding into the picture, it really made the whole project possible. It's a perfect example for other smaller communities who maybe don't want to use as much of their funding towards electricity. They can apply for a grant from us and really offset a lot of the cost of their electricity and use those funds to develop programs to improve the lives of everyone in these rural communities. As a lieutenant governor, I get to travel all over the state and I see these amazing projects, the innovation that's happening everywhere, and to see especially the kids talking about it, not just the community. And they're talking about it in classrooms now. They're learning about the innovation, learning about solar energy. Really what's incredible about this is the partnership between Rocky Mountain Power and Siemens and the local school district, making it possible for something to occur that, that a school district like North Sampi could never have afforded to do otherwise. It's saving money for the school district and, and that means more money into the classroom where we desperately need it. Governor Herbert recognizes the power of unprecedented partnerships to realize unparalleled results, and certainly the long-standing collaborations between the Office of Energy Development and our friends at Rocky Mountain Power exemplify what we can achieve together. This latest project that we've worked on in North San Pete County, I think is one of our best to date, where we've elevated education, we've elevated energy and our economy, and we've realized a true win-win-win for the state of Utah. To have these buildings upgraded the way that they are, this is world class now. The classrooms here in this district are top notch. Thanks to help from Rocky Mountain Power's Blue Sky program, we were able to make this whole project possible. It allowed us to put up all these solar panels and generate revenue that'll help pay off our bond. It actually helped us to get the financing at the best possible terms to really make this project doable for our district. And it was Blue Sky that made that all possible for us.